Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, it is Thursday. Oh, you've got a nice shot of my... Oh, good grief. What is that? <laughs> like, that's weird. Is that it? There it is. That's what it is. <laughs> I was going to say, you have a nice shot of my my ceiling and whatever that was that was covering the, the camera. Good, good afternoon. And um, welcome to Purple Pinky Promises. I'm going to jump on here and see if I can um, follow comments along uh, with you today. And we shall see how this goes. One moment. If you're here, Say hello. That was covering the oh. camera. <laughs> and I'm in, I'm in the stereo. <laughs> fun, 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 fun. Okay, there we go. Awesome. All right. So today we are going to uh, use some glitter paper. Who here is not afraid of glitter? You can't be afraid of glitter to use glitter paper, of course. And, um, it's gonna sparkle and shine about as bright as that snow out there today. So we are gonna have fun with glitter paper and I added some glitter paper to the store. So I thought, well, let's just combine some products here and create something beautiful and sparkly and something that just, to me, signifies hope, a rainbow. So I am going to uh, show you my products that I'm planning on using here today. And let's see, let's start with this. This is the, the main product that we're using today. It has glitter all over it from die cutting all the parts and pieces to the card. So I have these A2 nested domes uh, from Waffle Flower. And I have five pieces to the rainbow, which each one of these pieces works perf perfectly. What I did was I took each size, the larger and the next size down, and I lined them up, used some washi tape, and ran it through the die cut. And then I put back the larger one, used the smaller one, and went for the next smaller one, and so on and so forth until I was out of dies and which was actually the exact number of uh, pieces of card, glitter cardstock um, in the pack that we're using today. I'll show you that. It is this gumdrop glitter cardstock pack, and it is from Colorbook, Colorbook, sorry, Colorbook. And um, it's just got some really beautiful, gorgeous, glittery uh, pieces and colors, and yeah, there's glitter everywhere. So it's got this gold, kind of yellowish gold and some orange and some purple and green and this beautiful teal color. So gorgeous uh, pieces of cardstock. And um, cardstock from Colorbook. Color <laughs> anyway, and then I am playing around. I know for sure I'm going to use this stamp set for, from Sunny Studio. And it is the inside greetings birthday, but we're going to actually use an inside greeting for the outside greeting. And I have another idea for the inside. You'll see. And I think I'm going to use the uh, happy birthday dies or the happy birthday from this die set. This is the uh, classic words die from Pink Fresh. So Sunny Studio, Pink Fresh, Waffle Flower, and Color Book. And some other products here. We've also got uh, picket fence uh, gems, and we're gonna get started. Grab my, my bin. All right, so here are my parts and pieces to my rainbow. And I actually did not really cut them out in rainbow order. I honestly, it doesn't matter to me, they're rainbow cut mostly rainbow colors. And so I just decided that I liked this color arrangement. I mean, you could put them in rainbow uh, order, but I didn't. And I, one of the things is that I didn't really necessarily like the 
gold and the, the green next to each other as much. So I just thought I'd do this instead. Anyway, it is what it is and I like it. So <laughs> you could change it the way you wanted to if you decide to do this project. I'm gonna grab my scissors and I'm actually going to snip off. I could have gone all the way down to the edge of the paper, but I didn't because I decided I wanted a perfect strip to use for something else. I have kind of uh, an idea. Hi, Lindy, good afternoon. I kind of had an idea for the inside uh, on these strips. So uh, we'll see how that pans out. And they're perf they'll be perfectly uh, cut out, ready for what I was thinking of doing. Hey, Skip. <laughs> Hi. Oops, I didn't quite get that. I have the the uh, curtains open here from the the uh, French doors, and who it's bright. I can hardly see. <laughs> It's really bright out there today. I bet it's really bright out there for you guys too. You've got lots of land to, to look out from or look out at. I'm sure it's bright. Well, if I could cut it right today, you might get some even cuts here. Uh, we're we're going to have, if you're, who's afraid of glitter? I'm not afraid of glitter. Glitter's going to go everywhere today and it's okay. It cleans up. Some people don't like to clean up glitter, but I don't care. It doesn't bother me. As a matter of fact, I think it, I got some on my face. I saw some on my face when I was getting ready to come down here. I had glitter all over my face. I was just going to glisten and shine, match my project. I can see you. I can. I'm borrowing John's phone so that I can see the the, the feed. I still don't have the the uh, mechanism inside of uh, this program to to read any kind of dialogue. I can on Facebook, but I cannot on YouTube. And I've researched it everywhere, and I just don't see anywhere where I'm able to do that. Okay, so I have all my parts and uh, cut for this. So this is actually, here's what's cool, is these are actually now layered in such a way that they stagger perfectly, which is kind of cool. So if you see that, because they're um, gradual colors and, they'll, and the sizes are like this. So I have an idea for something on the inside of the card to use for that. So that's kind of fun. All right, let's get rolling here. And, oh, did I forget? No, that's, oh, the, the other thing I was gonna mention is that the inner, or the, the leftover pieces, this is like the gift that keeps on giving. With your inside, the pieces that um, are left over after your die cutting, how pretty is, I mean, you could actually do something with these pieces too, and, but, Wow, look at these. You could do end up doing a project with this as well. So that would be really gorgeous to do something with the leftover pieces. That's a, another project idea. So, yeah, fun. All right. I'm going to set these here. I don't want to ruin them. All right. Did I get that? I did. So how, how are you guys doing? Certain, um, yeah, I'm not afraid of glitter. Bring it on. <laughs> it's fun. So I'm going to lay this out. Glitter is definitely fun. So I am, uh, I need my orange next. I'm going to lay this out. But So before I actually start putting this down, I just kind of want an idea of where and how much room I have for my sentiment. Because my sentiment is actually going to go right inside of here. So I have plenty of room for the sentiment, don't I? Now I don't want, I really don't want glitter on my, on my project when I'm trying to stamp because if I, it could cause me to, um, 
not get a clear image if I have glitter. So let me get this hammer fiber cloth out and see if I can get that to clean off a little bit better. Yay. Now I have it on me. <laughs> okay. So I was looking at this and I thought, oh, hoping the year ahead brings many wonderful new adventures your way. I like that sentiment. So that's the one I'm going to use today. All right. Let me grab a block here. I am going to shimmer and shine after. Definitely, I'm going to shimmer and shine. Be the glowing. I'll tell my husband he didn't realize he married an angel. <laughs> I've been somewhere over the rainbow for sure. Um, okay, I'm using the Versa Claire, Versa Fine Claire. It is the Nocturne. It's in the store, and I'm going to stamp it about right about right here. It may not be centered, but it's where it's going. Okay, might be a little off just that way, but that's okay, because I've got all kinds of stuff to, we can fix that. So here we go, glue, gluing it down. And it's probably, it's gonna be staggered, but that's okay too, because Maybe that's kind of the look I'm going for is kind of a staggered rainbow look. This is probably the hardest part to this card. To make this easier, to have a panel like a four and a quarter by five and a half panel would make this a little bit easier. But the fact that I'm using liquid glue makes it a little less difficult too. So bring that out to the edge. All right, number one. You guys, you guys got power. You do know, obviously. You have, well, you could have be out of power and still be using your cell phone if you just lost power. Hope everybody's doing okay. I know these are some tough times for a lot of people right now. It's not fun. I'm certainly, people. I've been praying for people in Texas and all those affected by this bad weather. That's not something y'all are used to, and I'm really sorry that uh, circumstances are very, very unfortunate. It's kind of sad. Okay. Lining that up. This is why we use liquid glue. really want it to butt up there. I don't want any gaps. Yay. So as you can see, we're going to have a gradual inside. And I guess if it it might bother you, but it doesn't bother me. I actually I like it. I think it's kind of fun. It's a different look. We always see the flat edge on those rainbows and this just gives it a different look. I just, I think Lindy just got, you just got my message about Tora. I think I saw you, our kitty cat Tora. She was such a piece of work this morning when my husband went to go take, oops, I got glitter on there, or glue on there. Um, he went to take the, bring the laundry down and she was hiding in the laundry basket. Her little tail was sticking out and she did not want to get out. He had the worst time trying to get her out of the laundry basket. Her little tail was all fluffy and sticking out. <laughs> She's hilarious. She was, like I told Lenny, she was probably hiding because she'd done something that we hadn't discovered yet. She's wanting to kind of be a refugee down here where it was safe from being in trouble. She didn't get into trouble. <laughs> she just, 
She gets an earful, but she doesn't get into trouble. She's so cute. She's adorable. Come on, gold puppy. I think I went up too far, maybe. Did I go up too far? Getting it in there, yay. And look at the glitter, it's glittering everywhere. I like that, yay. Yay, yay, yay. So, more shimmer and shine coming to this card with the picket fence um, gems. That are gonna go on this. How pretty, how pretty, how pretty. I'm just thinking that glitter on there actually looks really kind of pretty. I'm thinking keep it on there. The last one, please cooperate. I may have to re glue that. Possibly. I wiped off the glue, but maybe not. Yay! Oh, how pretty. Love that. I know, don't dip your card in the ink. That's not wise, is it? <laughs> okay. I am going to. These little, I'm thinking I'm gonna do the inside before we put any any gems on the outside. I'm thinking that this who did I I'm missing the happy. It's probably in the bin. Let's hope it's in the bin. I might need one of those little pieces for the the dot on the eye. those over here. Everybody with me? Yay, we're still here. We had to open up the underneath storage area underneath here so that our pipes wouldn't freeze. And it's chilly down here. It's, it's quite cold. I've got the fireplace going and it's... Ooh. So cold. Okay, so the white on white, not so sure. I was thinking that perhaps maybe I might um, grab one of these leftover pieces and really pretty. So maybe cutting off a piece of that. Hmm. No, I don't want to do that. I might use a shadow. Let's see how that looks. I had this left over from my Facebook Live the other day. Yeah, that might work. Let's do that as a shadow. Yeah. Um, yep, yeah, that's what I want. Um, so I, I ended up not choosing this. I had some choices I, I had cut out prior and thought, eh, maybe I will uh, just use it for another project. And here I am using it on a project for today. So that's perfect. I don't think I caught that. Silly woman. You did not catch that. So I'm doing a shadow because the white on white, um, even though I'm gonna put put these behind, I, I'm letting the cat out of the bag here. I'm going 
going to do something to the effect of bringing the stripes across, maybe across the bottom where there's the white. So, like so. That's what I'm looking at. I'm looking at this. How fun is that? To use those leftover pieces. Bring that down. Like so. So yeah, that's what I'm looking at on the inside. And that is exactly where I want it to go. I think maybe just up a tad. So that stripe's gonna go there. This is how I measure. <laughs> there is no science for me in the world of card making, that's for sure. Measuring, I do measure some things. I, I take that back. So I, you know, of course, measure my card stock, but. go from there. So I glued this down first because my happy birthday is going to slightly overlap it and I want to be sure Sure these are straight before I put them on because I was cutting them wonky. Maybe that's why the cat wanted to come down here. She knew I had a rainbow project going on, all the glitter. She and John were engaged. Did I do this wrong? I did. Wrong one. Saved it. Um, she and John were engaged in this little war yesterday. He kept putting his napkin in the bowl when he was done eating, and she kept jumping up there and grabbing it out of the bowl. And he took it away from her, and she and he put it back in the bowl, and she jumped right back up there and grabbed it away from him, from the bowl. It was hilarious. It's actually kind of like this, almost a comedy routine. It's funny. She's been, she's a pistol. She was, um, she likes to go and lay down. This is our little kitten, Tora. She's, um, she likes to go and lay down right before I go to bed. She got, goes and plops down right where I'm supposed to lay down. She likes to take my spot. Little stinker. She's so cute. She's a little torty. And she has got, she's actually got sweet torty tude. <laughs> she's precious. She's our little gift from Skip and Lindy. She's definitely livened, livened things up around here. Our other cat, Timber, isn't always happy about it. And now I'm going to have glitter from scratching my face. Do I shine? <laughs> Maybe I'll discover a new form of makeup, huh? <laughs> okay. Um, the birthday goes on. So John was on live with me yesterday on Facebook, and I didn't know it. And I told him it. I, I actually was like joking with him one day and I said, I know what you're gonna do one of these days. You're gonna get on Facebook and like freak me out. I'm gonna see my name up there and I'm gonna go, how's my name up there? And then I'll realize that we share a Facebook account. <laughs> anyway, um, but it was so funny because he hopped on and uh, <laughs> I know Tor is so sweet. He hopped on Facebook yesterday and I, 
he said, uh, is it just me, but I can't see your workstation. And I thought he was joking because he's always, he's always pranking me with something. Seriously, always teasing me about something. He can't be serious about hardly anything. And so, um, luckily I had people on with me live and they were like, yeah, no, we can't see your workstation. I was on for almost 15 minutes. And I didn't have my workstation cast on the screen. What a silly woman. I had a bad headache yesterday morning. I wasn't really, I wasn't very functional. So, if you happen to see that, if you're watching the replay on this and you happen to see it, yeah. I was not doing my best yesterday. Although the card kind of turned out cool. It's a cool masculine card. So this card could be a masculine card too. Which is kind of nice. Could go either way. Although it's really shiny. It's shiny and sparkly. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to use one of those pieces. For the dot on the eye. So I think I... Yeah. We're just going to use this because I have no idea what happened to the dot of the eye. We're going to wing it and put this on here. Now the hard part is trying to fit. What in the world do I have inside my, oh, it's glue. It'll come out. Yay. This card's gonna have to be cleaned up just a little. It's got some glue on it. So I was thinking like so. Is that fun or what guys? Ah, love it. That's fun. I'll get my eraser out and get that. weird. What do I have all over me? Is that ink? Oh, you guys, if that's ink. <laughs> it's funny, but not funny. <laughs> I hope it's not ink. I hope that's glue. Oh, dear. I have ink on my fingers somehow. Sad. I don't know what that is. Oh well, you know what? Here's here's to fail. I don't know. It's black, and I don't know what it is. Um, that is bizarre. I'll work at it later. I bet you I can get it out somehow. Or I can put something over there. I'll just put another white panel over it. You know how we are as crafters. We can figure this stuff out. There's something. Oh my gosh, you guys. Look, it's that ink. That's what it is. My ink wasn't dry. Well, thankfully, it didn't smudge the sentiment. Well, yeah, this is a week of live. <laughs> and you know what happened? Like, right before I went live, um, on my iPad, I have the, uh, the Magic Keyboard. It stopped working. It says that the, it doesn't recognize the device. So yeah, mm -hmm. I told you every time. Technology doesn't ever fail. It, it fails to never fail. It, it never fails to fail. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. That's good times. So now I'm just on a roll. It'll still be a pretty card. All right, I'm picking out some gems here that I, I know that I will want. Um, I, all these colors will work with this card stock. So if you're going hunting in the, the, um, in the store, it all works. Most definitely all works. Whoops. 
That is not what I wanted. Where's that purple? I want some purple. There's some little purple pieces. There it is. Well, that one's broken. Here's one. I thought there were bigger purple pieces, but there aren't. They're all small. This is a day for some anti-static, for sure. Okay, I'm gonna do one more. And purple, because they're so small. Um, what we got going on here? Some of this looks green, and it is, I think. Nope, it's blue. How fun is that? Yeah, it's that blue. When it reflects, it looks green. Okay, so I'm gonna grab some of these pinks. And I got a couple of oranges, and we're ready to go. Let's just do some random pieces of sequence. I'm thinking maybe I should clean that up before it becomes a horrible mess. Got something here to clean it with too. It's on there. I'll have to get some rubbing alcohol. Are we shaking? We're shaking! Everybody get under the table. <laughs> okay. I think we're pretty safe now. Let's just go random circles. Oops, the plot clogged. Where else? Let's get those on and then we'll see. Right? If you're here, tell me where you're from. I know Skip and Lindy, I know where you're from. If anybody else is on here, holler at me and tell me where you're from. I don't want that color. I actually want this. It is the Gem War. There we go. If at first you don't, I don't really necessarily want it there anyway. So I'm thinking I'm gonna move it up here. I might end up with a different one there. It is the gem where, and so we should put our hand in it too. That'd be great. Let's do that. There, now we're, now we're doing it. just seems to need a lot more, doesn't it? Just seems a little sparse in there. So let's just keep going. There's one there. I think I'll do... Let's put some more glue on there. It's probably drying out. Let's 
to blue. What's going on here? There we go. Got that. Let's do a, a small one over here. Turn these little purple. Stay. There we go. Um, I need something in here. Orange. Orange will work right there, won't it? Just the minute you think, oh, it's not going to take a long, it's not, not going to be a long life. It's a long life. You're going to be on for a minute. Let's see, what else do we have here? looking at it. I know I need something there. Maybe. Maybe something over here. Let's do that. Let's get one more purple. Get another purple out. Those are hard to see. Put that purple here. I wish I had some, what else do I have? Do I have any other? Hmm. That's some Captain Cooler. Yes, this, when in doubt, add more. Yes, more. <laughs> Thinking some of these little flowers would be pretty on there. Let's try them out first. See what they look like on here. So now we went from whoop, there they go. Stop, let go. Oh, those are cute on there. I like them. Is that a big yes? I can say yes. Those are cute. We'll put a few of those on there and put one more. It does need some sequins for sure. I might get some big purple ones out of here and add those because they've kind of got that bluish purple. Um, let's get some of these. Yes. I do like those. These are the, these are the Catherine Cooler Love Lady Sequin Mix. Definitely a yes. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Come here, little flowers. And cooperate. I think they're stuck together. Sometimes when you get a sequin mix, the, you get a thick. Um, yeah, there's a few in there. Stuck together. I saw those. Unbelievably so. Okay, let's get, yeah. Oh, yeah. Here, that can go up there. You liking that? Yes, <laughs> I thought so. It's looking good. It's it was a little sparse and it needed some more needed some more oomph to it. Definitely. Now I'm not gonna know what's already down, and yeah, I know what's down. <laughs> okay, I'll stick something up there, and I think. here. Yeah. I'm liking that a lot. See, the more you add, the more you need. <laughs> is that the thing that is that what happens?
I think that maybe another big one. Is that what I need? Do I need another big sequin or a bigger sequin? Come on. I think I'm needing the bigger. It's not a little too heavy. There we go. Perhaps this one. Yes? Okay. I think we got it. I might add another yellow flower. Whoops, what am I doing? I need that. I'll bring that down. Sometimes I like to layer my sequins. I think I've got a glop that needs to be fixed there. Do you layer your sequins inside of sequins sometimes? That's fun. Maybe that's what I need to put like so inside like this. That's fun. Just to get it give it an added effect there. And I might just do that. Let's get this one up. Bring it over here. Oh yeah, sequins everywhere. Did you see that? You saw that, didn't you? <laughs> well, luckily it's my craft room and not yours, isn't it? <laughs> Good times, good times. <laughs> now I can see them better. Woohoo! Yay. Well, sometimes it's a happy accident, isn't it? <laughs> sometimes not so much. I am going to put, I think I'm going to put one of these little purple ones inside of there just to give it a little. Now it's stuck on there because I got glue on it. We're having all kinds of happy accidents over here. There. Nope. Don't touch it. Leave it alone. I can hear that on the other side of the cyber world. Leave it alone! Yeah, I'm gonna, these bigger ones, I'm gonna layer for sure. I'm going to get a blue inside of that one. So I haven't put that one down yet. That's why it's coming up. Okay. Let's put her down. <laughs> I know. Isn't it just about like, what do they call that? You're just pretty sure that, I don't really like that one. Uh, Murphy's Law. Yep. It's going to happen. It's bound to happen. That's too big. It needs another small one in there. Yeah. Let's put a small. I am so glad this glue dries clear. It dries clear and it dries nice clear. All right. Let's get this up and start putting some glue down on it. Pay attention, Donna. go. Okay, that's down, that's down, that's down. <laughs> I told you I was going to start forgetting which ones were down and which ones weren't. Definitely need another flower somewhere else. Maybe kind of over here. I'm going to bring this one over here. So cute. Those little yellow flowers are darling. Okay, we've got that down, that's down. Yep, that one's not. I might put... I gotta watch this later and laugh my, laugh my butt off at myself. <laughs> Some people, yep. 
you're allowed to laugh at my demise because it's funny. And, hmm, I don't know if, yeah, I might, I might not. All right, let's get, I thought about putting a flower inside that. That'd be cute, wouldn't it? And we'll see. Stay down. And that's on. That's not. And I think this card is done. You could finish it off with a bow. Um, maybe not. Uh, maybe not a bow. You could. You could put a bow like down here somewhere. I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to leave it like it is. Am I on the wrong side? We're gonna find out. I think I like it. Do I need the side? Do we want another flower in there? I was gonna see what a flower would look like inside. Oop, did I drop it? I did. Inside here. Like so. Come on, let go. kind of do. I am going to put one in there. And then, I got another one of these little, I'm going to go ahead and, there we go. Do I want another one of these here to kind of break up those flowers is what I was thinking. off one of these very carefully which I might do because it's still wet yep stick that in there and yay um, maybe just leave that one be I'll wipe off the glue later I like that better I do I do Yay. I think I got it. You like it? <laughs> I do like it. It turned out cool. It's fun. A lot of fun. I know that everybody has somebody in their life that likes rainbows and would love to receive something fun and sparkly in the mail. I know some people like to, to send this kind of stuff to people who don't like confetti or don't they'll do it just to be ornery <laughs> so you can you can do that <laughs> I know I know there are some crafters out there that like to do ornery stuff like that <laughs> anyway I uh, hope you enjoyed uh enjoyed being here with me today thank you for joining me I really really appreciate it it means a lot to me hit the subscribe button don't forget to subscribe to my channel and you won't miss when I'm on here live and at least you'll get a notification. You can watch it later if you're not able to join me while I'm here live. But I am always live over on Facebook on Tuesday mornings at 10 a.m. also. And um, I'm planning on getting some of those videos moved over here as well so that you can view those if you're not a Facebooker. I know some people have left the Facebook platform or they just um, don't like Facebook. So uh, I'm going to start moving some of those videos over here as well. Anyway, 
Uh, have a good day. Ha we are approaching the weekend, so have a great weekend as well. And stay warm. We have hope. It is warming up. <laughs> have a good day. Bye-bye.